Hello, my name is Scott Vigil, and I am a senior concept artist, uh, also a general art generalist, and I am wanting to put together just a little bit of info so that you know who I am and what my capabilities are. So, as you can see, a lot of my work is 2D and 3D digital stuff. Uh, I work with uh, various 3D uh, sculpting programs, as well as uh, 2D sculpting packages. And a lot of the things that uh, you see here are on the aisles of places like Walmart and Target. So I have a lot of uh, professional experience putting out titles that will be uh, presented. I have a background in animation as well as uh, fine art. Uh, my art skills are traditional drawing, character design, environment painting, uh, compositing, character motion graphics, and animation. You can see that uh, my, my software, I know how to use Blender, Figma, Photoshop, like the back of my hand, 20 years experience, uh, as well as various other motion graphics and special effects uh, products. But you guys need someone that is a designer. Uh, you have a zero knowledge universal sediment, sediment, settlement layer. And so I want to show you how I can work with that because uh, one of my great interests is blockchain. And so here is, this is one, uh, it's a privacy coin that I've done some work for to do uh, uh, various ads. Uh, just to bring, you know, infographics uh, to something that otherwise did not have any marketing. I as well have put out uh, NFT collections. Uh, this would be a nominate Darrow Punks, uh, the Black Swans of Darrogan, and then I also did the banner art for Darrow Cats, as well as all the logos. Uh, there have been several uh, mobile uh, mobile wallets that I have done uh, kind of the uh, that I've put together. One, this is the G45 wallet uh, for Darrow. And in it, they had something that looked very rudimentary and kind of ugly and black and white. And I just kind of spiced it up with some color. Uh, this is an older uh, wallet concept that I did for Incognito. Incognito Chain is no longer around, but the art assets are. Uh, Re-art concept ideas for DEXs to make them more playful, more fun. This is Darrow Cutie Pie, which stands for Quick Trades, Private and Exchange. I've taken uh, very, very ugly websites in, and I've worked on making design languages for this would be for private islands, uh, building up all the assets and working with the developers on uh, what the elements should look like. Uh, basically, it's design language and flow, uh, making interactive characters that people can work with so that it's more end user friendly. I'm just kind of working backwards, uh, but uh, giving sketches, fundraisers, subscriptions, bounties, and some fun parallax effects. So this was all for uh, Darrow Private Islands, which is kind of, uh, it's coming up as a bounty, fundraiser, and Kickstarter campaign, all in one website, private and encrypted. Uh, I've worked on logos. Uh, this is for Darrow Webb, and this one is for kind of a resurrected Twitter called Phoenix. The idea is a bluebird dies, and then a red bird resurrects that's more private and uh, uh, more permissionless, and you own your own data. So 
those are some things that I did there, as well as some more infographics uh, trying to break down uh, for Darrow why privacy matters and why you need to have it as part of your security model because data is a type of centralization. Also done some uh, unique uh, cartoons to try to be humorous, but to show uh, what sort of things you can have if you have privacy and if you have smart contracts with privacy. So a lot of these concepts on the blockchain I'm very familiar with, and I'm sure that that would be of use to you. I have also worked uh, with another developer taking what is kind of like, again, this is Phoenix, uh, but it looked pretty bad. And just within a couple of days, I made something that looked a lot more friendly, uh, putting um, uh, with identicons in there so that you can kind of tell who's talking because it is a, a, a privacy centric place. And so you would, you kind of need to know what people are saying. Uh, who's saying what, and then this would be being a uh, mobile wireframe example that I made up for him. And that was just to get it looking a little bit more like something that anyone would want to use. I did this Darrow ecosystem, uh, and the uh, Darrow ecosystem, uh, in it a lot of people did not have any um, any logos or anything like that. So uh, a lot of these logos I made for various projects, Tree Market, Airbnb, Darrow Web, Phoenix, as well as just putting together this whole sort of ecosystem infographic so that people could put it up on Twitter so that people could know that the project has some legs, trying to get uh, early information out there to spark interest. Uh, simple infographics. This ended up going on a clothing line that I put out. Uh, I also do various sorts of branding for music, music artists, uh, this being Modern Rock Octopus, which is uh, a person I work with in, in another field. And I also do motion graphics. So uh, an example of sort of parallax effect that I was trying to do. For a web splash teaser. Uh, I work with Adobe After Effects, so this is to try and be just a little bit edgy, grab people's attention, and be put to cycle. Uh, this is just a flash to grab people's attention. Uh, it's like four seconds long, and it's meant to be on loop. Uh, this one being a slower one that was part of the uh, information thread, uh, talking about the capabilities of the chain. And again, all of these are very edgy because it's a very cypherpunk sort of ethos uh, that that they want to go for. And so, yeah, this was all done in Adobe After Effects, and it's just regular motion graphics uh, for something like Twitter posts, social media, Instagram posts. And then the last thing that I will leave with you is... Uh, an ad that I did for a wallet. This is a concept ad that I put together. So I actually made a prototype that's interactive uh, in Figma. And uh, then I recorded myself using it and put music to it. And this is how it ended up.
So notice that the colors went with the whole UI. Um, anyway, uh, blockchain is of great interest to me and I have a lot of experience working with a bunch of different people at a bunch of different levels on it. And I'd be very excited and very interested to work on your project as well. So thank you very much. My name is Scott and I look forward to hearing back from you.